So the question was asked in one of the Facebook groups is, uh, can you uh, create a multicolored letter inside Cricut Design Space using a, using a font? Um, obviously you can, here it is. And let me go ahead and show you how we did it. So obviously this is split into three separate uh, things here, but I'm gonna go ahead and start fresh. So I'm gonna go ahead and replace it. And let's just go ahead and add a font. So I just chose the letter R here. And I did choose a, a system font. I chose of Arial just because it was, uh, usually those are nice and thick. So I'm gonna go ahead and increase the size. Uh, the next thing that I wanna do is I'm gonna go ahead and grab a shape. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a square. However, I'm gonna turn this square into a rectangle. So unlock it so I can adjust the size and proportions. And I'm, I'm just gonna go ahead and cover it up like so. Uh, you know, you can adjust the sizing however you wish. But anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and select both and I'm gonna go ahead and click on the slice button. So I can go ahead and get rid of this, okay? I can also get rid of this gray piece right here. Don't need it. Uh, but now I am left with uh, three pieces. So let me go ahead and color this one white. Okay, and now for this, uh, I'm going to go ahead and change this color here to the red. But you notice that the, the right side is, is red as well. So how can we uh, get this to a different color? Well, let me go ahead and select this. I'm going to click on Duplicate. And just so that we can uh, line things up here, I'm going to go ahead and uh, click this. I'm going to click the other red item, and I'm going to go ahead and align it uh, to the left. And then I'm also going to align it to the top. And now I, I have it uh, exactly where I need it to be. And now with one of these, uh, it doesn't, I don't care which one, but I can click on it. Let me go ahead and change this to blue. And now I can click this one more time. And I'm going to choose the contour button. And I'm going to go ahead and select it. And then we're done. So now we have the, the single letter that is now multicolored inside of Cricut Design Space. And uh, that's how you can do that utilizing Slice uh, so that you can uh, grab and color code the way that you want.